For nearly a decade, we've watched the Saints as they rose from humble beginnings to becoming an unstoppable force of nature. In that time, we've seen how the Saints rose to power. We've seen how the Saints enact vengeance. We've even seen how the Saints... What did you have? I just think there's more important things to think about than some bullshit holiday. Looks like someone never got on the nice list. Yeah, and see, that's the thing. There is no nice list. So Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Yule, Festivus? You don't care about any of it? That's right. You don't like the songs? No. Nope. You don't like the gift giving? I already take whatever I want. I said giving. Whatever. You don't get excited about setting up the Nightblade Nativity every year? Oh, that's slightly intriguing, but no. What about Santa? Fuck Santa! What's happening? Were we hit? No, the proximity alarm didn't go off. This is something different. Shandy? Fuck me. We don't have a lot of time. Claus is coming. What? Claus. A warlord from my time, your future. By the time we learned about him, it was too late. He was too powerful. The only chance we had to stop him was to send me back here to warn you. Oh, wait. If you could go back in time, why don't you go back even further and warn us about Xenia? Isn't that a little more important? You don't get it. This isn't about Earth. Come midnight, Christmas Day, Santa Claus is coming to town, and unless we stop him, he is going to put the universe on the naughty list. And trust me, you don't want to be on the naughty list. Sorry I asked. So Santa's evil? No, Zinyax had Santa trapped for decades, slowly but surely degrading his mind. If we don't free him soon, it'll be too late, and he'll never be jolly old Saint Nick again. Guys, this is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. All right, all right, I'll save Santa. Another terrible fucking sweater. Thanks, Kinsey. In Santa's nightmare world, the holiday spirit doesn't exist. So if you want to bring it back, you wear whatever it takes. Real guns aren't allowed here, so we'll have to check the store and do a little holiday shopping. Also, be careful of your language around Santa. We're trying to stay on his nice list. Seriously, honey? Come on, the town department store is just ahead. Is there a crowd here? They're here for the Crimson Cowboy Carbine Action 200 Shot Range Model Air Rifle. Crimson Cowboy! What have you done? It's just one naughty thing. <laughs> Deal with the causes. Look. Those who are naughty look to the sky and see your doom with the naked eye. You willfully break the world's laws. Now feel the wrath of the mighty claws. Well, fudge. Come, come as fast as you can. 
You can't stop me or my gingerbread men. Evil cookies are supposed to be a threat? Whatever. Let's see this crimson cowboy do its thing. Wait! Claws is still too strong, and you'll shoot your eye out! Is it really you? I always warn children about the dangers of such toys. But why do you look so thin? The holiday spirit doesn't exist here anymore. Claus made sure of that. So, Santa. How do we stop him? Start by ringing the holiday bells in the town park. That should bring a little spirit back to the people. Here, ring the bells and then let's kill Claus. My dear Shandy, don't let your metallic parts turn your heart cold as well. Remember the holiday spirit you felt when you were younger. You know my mother? Sam, I've had no choice but to harden myself to fight the war. I... I forgot how I used to be. Don't worry. That same girl is still inside you. In fact, I'll bet there'll be a brand new hockey sack under the tree for you this year. You need it? Thanks, Santa. Yes, it works. Bells began ringing in the cheer, but more needs to be done. What all do I have to do now? There was once a theater in town that played one of the great holiday classics, but the projector was stolen and frozen in a pool by claws. Find that, and the people will remember what they loved about the holidays. We defeat him by playing a movie? It is not just a movie! It is a symbol of all that is good about this time of year! Don't worry, Sam. We can get the projector. Take out the guards so they don't hurt the projector when you grab it.
me just break this ice. must get it to the drive-in theater and turn on the magic of the season. It's a movie, nothing more. Oh, it's more than simply that. It creates a feeling of joy and happiness that comes with remembering the warmth this season brings to those who embrace it. I highly doubt that. Yes, now quit being a Grinch. I told the other you I don't know what that means. Spirit, it stings and burns. But that's not enough for the tide to turn. We brought him down. But he's not defeated yet. The electricity here just isn't enough to keep the projector working. We need more. I noticed precisely that while viewing your progress from our ship. Meet me at the clock tower and I will increase the power. And it is a pleasure to meet you, Sam. Say better be here. Oh, at the top of the clock tower. Keep Cross's minions from hurting me while I set up a conductor on this antenna. How's that work? A storm is brewing. Lightning is sure to strike. <laughs> what a wonderful idea. You must be joking. Sam, do you know what happened to the North Pole? Sadly, I do. Claus has shown me images of an attack on my workshop. My head elf, Twinkle, has even joined with him. Twinkle. I remember him very well. He's the one who took my arm. I'm sorry, my dear, but there is hope. The rest of the elves are being led by Tinsel against Claude's not forces. And Mary? <laughs> Don't worry about Mrs. Claude, Charlie. I'm sure she can take care of herself and the North Pole until we arrive. That's good to hear. If Claus gets his hands on the North Pole, then we are in serious trouble. I need you to put your tongue on the pole to help conduct the electricity. The fuck you say? Not in front of Santa. Shonda, he wants to electrocute me. No. Well then, I dare you. Daring me isn't gonna change things. But this has to be done. Fine. I double dog dare you. Jesus, are you all right? Johnny, I'm not talking to you right now. The power is restored. 
Good luck defeating Claus. I can feel the people in town filling with cheer. Hurry, we must return to the drive-in. I'm glad someone believes this is going to work. The spirit's alive, but still I live. Come face me now. There's punishment to give. Don't let him fool you. He's weakening. Keep your suit on, Santa. I got this. Holiday here you cannot save. I will not go to an early grave. Oh, yes, you will, Claus. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, my God. How to get away? You cannot defeat Claus by doing naughty deeds, for those are what he thrives on. Claus is going after the North Pole, then we have to stop him. Indeed, you are correct. We cannot leave Mary and the elves to face him alone. Cars, elves, and the North Pole. I finally get to see it before it's been destroyed. <laughs> and perhaps make sure it never is. Claus has taken over Santa's workshop. He plans to deliver bombs and guns to children instead of, you know, dolls and trucks or whatever it is kids from your time like. The elves have mounted a resistance, but they will fail unless you help them. If Claus succeeds, the holidays are doomed. You must stop him. Here we are. My workshop is just ahead. Though it's hard to say what Claus has turned it into. How about Mrs. Claus, Santa? Oh, I wouldn't worry. If I know my wife, I bet she's decking the halls as we speak. Those savages have set my prized pine aflame. And is that... Is that Dancer? Dancer? Oh, oh no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, sweet Cupid. Vixen, what have they done? Had to find some cover, Santa! I didn't come here to observe, Charlie. I'm taking the North Pole back. Yeah, Santa, you tell me. What's going on, Pencil? Claus has taken over the workshop. He's doing people and the boys from shipping and receiving against us. Claus isn't going to get away with this. Twinkle even created a fleet of evil mechanical reindeer. So this is where the reign of mechanical animals began.
Looks like the workshop is ahead. Hmm. Mary has enacted emergency shutdown. That tinsel fella mentioned mechanical reindeer, right? Take us to this. killed my precious reindeer friends and made these these abominations God, one twisted you know what you know what i am not going to swear in front of s-a-n-t-a it's okay dear. naughty words aren't naughty deeds Down here. Santa, your time is over. Twinkle, how could you? Claus gave us a better deal, Plumby. Weekends off, sick pay, and we get to make guns. Real ones. He's on the move. My goodness! 
claws has turned Twinkle and his cohorts into giant elves. Giant elves? Where? Right there. Can't you see? Do you mean normal-sized people? Normal size for you, but giant for elves. Time to paint the snow red! The elves are in charge now! Down with Santa's tyranny! The elves hold the North Pole now, Batman! Claus is our Kringle now! <laughs> <laughs> 